It's an emotional time because they are both recovering well. Uh, and that's something that we really want to emphasize. Larry Wilder says Judge Drew Adams, Judge Brad Jacobs, and their families are all upbeat. Brad, uh, you know, has is, is got a little bit longer road, I think, uh, without question, that, that to, to travel than, than Drew in Indianapolis for the recovery. Drew's hopeful that he may be back home here with us in, in his recovery program here in Clark County in the, within the next couple of days. The two judges were in Indianapolis on May 1st for a judges conference. This video shows them at a White Castle shortly after 3 a.m. Two men emerged from a car and walked to the entrance. Police say words were exchanged, a physical fight ensued, and one of the other men shot Adams and Jacobs. Wilder was asked if he knew what was said between the two groups. Didn't ask any questions about that because I don't care. And the reason I don't care is this. My two friends, our two judges were shot. Wilder was careful not to comment on the police investigation or the suspects who are still at large. We know the Indianapolis police are going to do their job and they're going to do it well and they're going to come to the, to the place that they need to come to. Right now, judges are temporarily filling in. They'll be back on the bench. The question is, is it two months, three months, or whatever? Other judges will be appointed for longer terms as the men recover. Mark Vanderoff, WLKY News.